This Sudoku Primer video is another pop quiz. This is puzzle number 100. It's a diabolical puzzle from Sudoku to Go, volume 104, by Soap Opera Digest. You may not like it, but I am going to give you another pop quiz. But I'm the teacher, so I can do what I want. But don't worry, this, this pop quiz won't be graded, it won't count toward your grade. So you're okay as far as that goes. The way this works is I solve the puzzle with, without saying anything, and you see if you can follow along, see if you can see why I place each number where I place it. If you're not sure uh, why a certain number goes in a specific place. Uh, stop the video and study it if you if you want and uh, if you still can't figure it out uh, just leave a comment in the comment field and uh, you know with your question and the time when that in the video where that uh, number is placed and I'll reply and if you see questions out there in the comments and you know what the answer is, go ahead and reply. Uh, we can all learn together. Well, let's get started. Good luck. I hope you do well on this quiz. Um, before we actually get started on the quiz, I, I'm going to point one thing out because this is fairly rare. Don't see this too often, especially in uh, diabolical puzzles. But you see this column right here. We got one, two, five, six. Those are actually quadruplets here in this box right here. One, two, five, and six. So that's kind of interesting. We don't see those too often. Uh, and that'll probably help you on the quiz too if you keep that in mind. All right, well, let's get started on the quiz. Make sure you understand why I place each number when I place it.
Okay. Well, did you see why each number was placed where, where it was placed? I hope you're able to follow along. There were some parts of that puzzle that got a little bit tricky. You had to um, follow a kind of a, a chain of events in order to get it. Um, I hope that made sense. If it didn't, if you're not sure where why certain numbers were placed when they were, uh, like I said, uh, leave a comment and I'll, I'll reply. And uh, I hope that helps you uh, understand how to solve a, a fairly difficult puzzle. Thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you soon.